I put these two together and you can see the bottom one is much darker than the top one. We got a light blue with no logo and we have the dark blue with the logo. So keep your eyes open. Welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels TV. Today I got something really cool for everybody. Um, you guys know that I love packaging art. All the stuff, all the way back to the red lines, the Otto Cooney stuff. I love packaging art. Um, a lot of the cars nowadays have some really cool uh, artwork on them. And I really think that, you know, the, the artists... Uh, don't get their don't get their due, you know, like uh, like like the designers do. You know, we got great designers there. You got you got Phil Realman. You got you got Brennan Vitusky. Uh, you know, you, you these guys design the cars, but you got guys that design you know the packaging, the packaging art, um, which uh, you know the, I is, to me is just important as the car that is in the package. So. Um, you know, there's guys like Julian Coyles who does all of the, uh, the, the, the premium stuff, you know, um, and, uh, there's a, a guy, uh, a new friend of ours, his name is Matt Gabe, and he does the mainline stuff and the, uh, the other stuff, you know, that, that you find, uh, the, the, uh, uh, Halloween cars, the holiday cars, you know, the, the Easter or the spring cars, the, um, uh, Christmas cars, all of, all of that stuff. Um, uh, so there are, you know, two different ends of, of the packaging world at Hot Wheels. So, um, I got to talk with, uh, with Matt Gabe today and, um, uh, on these here, and I'm going to show you just what I'm talking about. These are the, uh, police car series that were at Walmart and we later on found them at, um, the dollar uh, Dollar Tree, all right? Uh, I got all of these from our friend Leonard. Um, he got these from the Dollar Tree, and these were at Walmart. Now you can see that one has the logo and one does not, and they did that on purpose. Uh, also, on the back of the card, the ones with the logo the uh, the control number is uh, K510, and the one without the logo is uh, K511, all right? So there are two different packaging uh, for this series. Uh, they were originally done at Walmart, and uh, which I missed out on. They came and went, and, uh, and I missed out on them. Uh, I saw one car hanging. I think it was uh, was this uh, BMW hanging there, uh, and and was searching for them ever since. And then I found them later on at the uh, at the Dollar Tree. Uh, but I heard about the 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 no logo packaging, and uh, never found them. So uh, thanks to our, our buddy Leonard uh, that we got them. So uh, let's check them out. Like I said, there are two totally different packaging for these. And for anybody who collects packaging or, uh, yeah, packaging art, like myself, and I know there's a lot of you guys out there that do, uh, including, uh, you know, packaging errors and packaging uh, uh, variations, things like that, uh, these are really cool. So uh, thanks to the guys at Hot Wheels for doing this for, you know, for us collectors. And again, this is, uh, you know, this is where the, to me, uh, and, and a lot of you guys, you know, that the car is just as important or the packaging is just as important as the car that's inside of it. Okay. So you got to have both of them, right? All right. So, um, the whole premise of this is since these are police cars that, um, the logo has gone missing. And if you look on the card, it shows the chase of the police car looking for the missing logo. So let's get to number one, and that is the 85 
Chevrolet Camaro police car that's done up in uh, gloss black. It's got uh, uh, highway patrol on the, on the door. Uh, got a white roof and a gray interior. Gray plastic base on it and it's running on uh, chrome PR5s. Now it's got a light blue tinted window. The card just shows the uh, the Camaro with uh, actually with lights up on the top, which the the car in the card does not, um, and a little laptop that says today in Hot Wheels news. Now the other one, the one with the missing logo, it says missing Hot Wheels logo on the laptop, and up above there is no logo; it's just white, and there's a bunch of question marks. And there's the Camaro up the top with the lights. Um, looks like they're they're flashing, where on this one it does not. And also down in here, the lights are flashing, and this one it does not. And uh, in the bigger picture, the lights are flashing, and this one it is not. So uh, number one, they are looking for the Hot Wheels, missing Hot Wheels logo. Number two is the Nissan Fair Lady Z. And that is done in white enamel. Got some black on the side, black on the nose. Uh, has a black plastic base. The wheels are uh, blacked out steelies all the way around. Interior is uh, gray, lightly blue tinted window. And uh, this one is uh, actually, let's do the one with, with the logo. Uh, same car, you know, both, all the vehicles, all the cars in the packages are the same. It's just that the package is a variation, okay? Uh, but hey, if you find anything with a different car in it, a you know, different variation of the car, let us know in the comments below. Um, this one, it says up at the top, it's got hot, and then there's a wheel. Uh, there is the, uh, the fair lady over in the corner. And uh, oh, actually down here, up on two wheels, like Joey Chitwood. I know you younger guys aren't going to know who Joey Chitwood was. Um, but Joey Chitwood used to have this thrill show where the cars would ride on two wheels. And actually a friend of mine I went to school with uh, used to do the slide for life. He would, uh, they go 70 miles an hour, and he would slide on this big piece of uh, leather on his butt. And he'd come around it because they did it at Utica Room Speedway one time. And they come around the corner, and there is my buddy Joey hanging on for dear life, helmet on. And he's they're dragging him 70 miles an hour on a uh, on a big piece of leather. Joey Chitwood Thrill Show. Um, and uh, no, the, the guy that was my buddy was not Joey Chitwood, uh, but a guy that lived here in Utica. Um, his name was Joey, and I'm not going to tell you his last name because anybody around here knows who Joey is. Okay? All right. All right, so this guy is up on two wheels, just like the Joey Chitwood Thrill Show. And uh, the uh, variation card uh, says up at the top, it says missing Hot Wheels logo, where the other one uh, just had a hat and a wheel. Um, lights on again. And down on the bottom, um, it says zing. Uh, and they're looking for, uh, you know, it's got totally, totally different graphics on this card. So... There you go. Number three is the uh, 2016 BMW M2, and that is done in a really dark metallic blue. Got some yellow on it. It says uh, police on the side. says uh, police backwards on the hood, and so you can see in your rearview mirror. Uh, it says police. And uh, what else to say on there? Uh, hyper, hyper scepter in white on the hood. Uh, has a black interior. Windows are tinted pretty dark. Wheels are blacked out. PR5s all the way around. Black plastic base. And uh, that's it for this one. But the uh, the card has a uh, police car chasing somebody up on the top. And uh, they've got police watch there. What, what do they call that? Uh, Apple watch or whatever. And the uh, car itself over there. And the one with the missing logo is uh, chasing a car up the top. Got a lot of, a lot of expression in the artwork. Over here on, uh, on the Apple Watch, it says 
missing logo. And the bigger picture, the lights are on and he's going real fast looking for the logo. I put these two together and you can see the bottom one is much darker than the top one. We got a light blue with no logo and we have the dark blue with the logo. So keep your eyes open uh, for the color swing on those. The uh, yellows are the same, but the paint color itself is definitely different as you can see. Cool. So really cool. Number four is the uh, Lamborghini Aventador Coupe. And that is done in white enamel. Got some really dark green on it. Headlights are done up nice. Tampo on the side says police. Got green striped. Interior is black. Windows are really, really dark. Riding on uh, blacked out PR5s. Big ones in the back, little ones in the front. And a black plastic base. The card uh, just has it uh, has a Lambo going uphill. And uh, got some, looks like some LA traffic there. And the in, inside laptop for the for the police car, and the police car itself. Missing logo package, and he's got his lights on. He's got uh, some exclamation points there, chasing somebody apparently. Over here it says missing logo, and uh, the big picture. He's got his lights on, and it says Vroom. And uh, but the LA traffic thing is still the same. <laughs> uh, but yep, yeah, missing logo and with the logo. Number five, last one up, is the Volkswagen Golf MK7. And that is done in uh, silver metallic. Has some uh, light blue on the hood and a darker blue on the side. So keep an eye out for that. Maybe there's a little, uh, little color variation or color swing on those. Let me know what you have for colors if you have these. Uh, it says Polizzi on the hood and Polizzi on the side. It has a black interior. The windows are very, very dark blue. Uh, wheels are dark gray painted trap fives all the way around. Black plastic base. And uh, the card, it says uh, forecast. Looks like uh, for, the, for the temperature. Thir uh, 90 degrees on Thursday. Not around here, man. I'm in New York. I would be lucky if I get 35 degrees on Thursday. But uh, cool. Uh, police on the top there. Police car. Police car on the side. And the one with the missing logo. Uh, he's up there. Got his lights on. Got some exclamation points. Um, and there is the same with the bigger picture on the right hand. It says uh, live breaking news. And uh, they have some question marks, exclamation points. The lights are flashing. And over on the left-hand side, missing logo. And you know, now that I put these two together, I can see that uh, the one with the light hood and the dark sides, this one does have a dark hood and dark sides. So I have a light and a dark hood. So keep your eyes open for that. Um, and we'll see if we can get them the other way or actually have, uh, have them all correct. Who knows? So there's a good possibility that there's a, a good bunch of different <laughs> color shades, color, uh, color swings on the, on the tampos on these. So keep your eyes open. All right, cool. So there you go. There are all five, actually all 10 of the, uh, the Hot Wheels Police Car Series from uh, Walmart, and then later on at the Dollar Tree. Um, with logo and without logo, missing logo. I love this stuff. This is really, really, really cool. I'm glad that, uh, that they did this. Um, hopefully, they'll do some more cool stuff like this too. And uh, actually, um, Matt was telling me that we should be looking for the, uh, the Halloween cars when they are coming out because he said there's going to be some really really cool stuff um, done with that packaging too so let's keep our fingers crossed and we can find them you know that's the thing you know being able to find them so uh there you go thanks for watching out wheels tv always great to see you guys here and uh always appreciate it please 
leave us a comment. Please give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Click that little bell so you know whenever we are going to do, uh, going to have another video out there for you. And uh, please be kind to one another. So until the next time we see you right here at Hot Wheels TV, you guys take care of yourselves. Hopefully we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.